FM1 Global presents... From the Ice Palace in St. Petersburg, Russia, the M1 Challenge, heavyweight division, Ahmed Sultanov, fighting in his home country, weighing in at 229 pounds, 27 years old, two wins, no losses, no draws, versus that man, Fuji Katsuhisa, from Japan, 35 years old. 242 pounds, eight victories, 13 losses, one draw, Jimmy. Well, he trains with Kazuyuki Fujita, who is a pride veteran, bullheaded, great wrestler. So I think that's the style we're going to see here. It's pretty much going to be a wrestling match. Sultanov said his background is Greco-Roman wrestling. Fuji listed wrestling as one of his strengths as well. Fuji wearing shoes, I think they're both looking for the takedown. Sultanov, though, quick to tell us in our fighter meeting, he has very good kicks. Katsuhisa says that he's got a good ground and pound style. When asked about his strengths, first thing out of Sultanov's mouth, let my opponent find out about my strengths. Didn't want to give too much to us or anybody else. Daisuke Noguchi from Japan, the referee in charge of this heavyweight contest, giving the final instructions. Now Fuji's got a little bit of a height advantage, a little bit of reach. Let's see how effectively he uses it. In the M1 challenge, Kicks to the head are legal as long as the opponent is standing, as long as you are not wearing shoes or boots. And as you can see there, Fuji Katsuhisa is wearing wrestling shoes, so he can only kick to the body. Kicks and knees to the head are not legal against a grounded opponent. Well, Fuji definitely looks like he's rather give up head kicks and be able to wrestle a little more effectively. As we see, shooting right away. Good sprawl by Sultanov, and he has his back. Sultanov, how clever was that? Getting the back. Looking for the belly-to-back suplex, well defended by Katsuhisa. It looks like Sultanov's back is glued to Fuji. Excellent here, control. Here comes the rear naked choke. Katsuhisa trying to defend. That's what Sultanov is looking for, Jimmy. Sultanov stepping over for the armbar, looking for the submission. Looking for the straight arm lock. He's rolling out of it. And that's the tap, it's over! Beautiful finish by Sultanov. Transitioning. Excellent, excellent transition from the back to the armbar. Straight almost right away. Beautiful, beautiful technique by Sultanov. Went for the rear naked choke, and that slick transition into the straight arm lock. Not often do you see a guy transition that well to the point where the guy can't even grab his arm and resist. That is quick, that is fast, that is a slick, slick transition. Devastating win for Ahmed Sultanov. Three victories in three MMA fights. Fuji looks like he's in some pain. That looks like a serious, serious armbar. It's a very well thought out victory by Ahmed Sultanov. You'll see here, had his back, had a little trouble getting the choke, stepped his leg out and stepped right over for the armbar before Fuji could defend himself. And that is straight. Whenever you deal with a heavyweight, that's a lot of weight on your arm. Very dangerous position. Excellent job stopping it by the referee. Incredible pressure on that left elbow. The last thing you want is a guy with that length and that strength sitting on your arm, totally undefended. No choice but to tap for Fuji. Excellent stop. You see the look of pain on Fuji's face. That tap was motivated by some serious, serious power. Winning with that devastating, beautiful armbar. Ahmed Sultanov in the first round defeats Fuji Katsuhisa.